Hey guys, so in case you didn't know, there is a cure for cancer. There always has been. I actually had cancer. Okay, guys. And I've been seeing videos like this pop up on my For You page a lot recently. So I figured I'd put my two cents in while we're having some coffee and comment and comment. Uh, I had cancer for six years, Hodgkin's lymphoma. And for f the first five of those years, I said no to chemotherapy, to conventional treatment thinking I was going to heal myself naturally with natural healing modalities, alternative therapies, all the goods. I wholeheartedly believed it, wholeheartedly believed it. An endless spiritual journey, awakening, death, Ugh, so much I could say. But I went from stage one to end stage cancer, the cancer completely exploding all over my body, being on my deathbed, tumors popping out my skin, couldn't walk, couldn't breathe, endless amounts of things. I was basically in a denial suicide at the end until I got hospitalized and eventually surrendered to chemotherapy, which saved my life. Do I believe that there are alternative healing and therapies and modalities out there for cancer? I do. I really do. Of course. There's so much natural healing and that is suppressed in our society. We all know that at this point. Big Pharma, all of that. We, we know. We know. Um, there's so many better ways to heal the body and take care of the body. But we live in this modern world right now where I believe balance is best. Do I believe in getting unnecessary things done to our body and shots and all that, blah, blah? No. But when it comes to life or death, you don't fuck around. And I had to learn that. I had to learn that. Even though, you know, I wasn't fucking around. I was trying everything I could every single day to save my life. But we need a balanced approach, in my opinion. We need conventional medicine plus lifestyle and natural healing when it comes to cancer. And I see a lot of misinformation out there. And people like me as a little 19-year-old, when I got diagnosed, I was soaking it in, soaking it in. And luckily, you know, I was saved by the grace of God. And it was part of my awakening journey. I had to go through that because now I am who I am, thank God. Mm. but I don't want to see other people get sucked into it you know Ooh, I would love to talk more about this guys but bye for now mm -hmm.